Salutations people, this is Razor13 here giving you a gameplay Call of Duty Black Ops Escalation Map Pack hit today and you know what that means. This is uh, my first uh, first new map that I encountered. First I didn't know what gun to decide on, but I stick with the FAMAS dual mags. And uh, this is the map Convoy, as you can see here it starts off the broken freeway, uh, which you can get under, as I show you right here. And it, each team starts up on opposite sides of that destroyed freeway section. So uh, I just figured there would be someone rushing, you know, on the other side, like I would. And I was able to pick them off here. Now, this map, uh, Convoy, is one of the four new maps that uh, Treyarch has put out for us. The other three being Zoo, Stockpile, and Hotel. <laughs> Knife this guy right here. I'm just gonna give you my impressions. Uh, I have played all the maps at least once, and uh, this was my first time on Convoy. And now with the new maps, every time there's new maps uh, up, uh, there's gonna be a lot of uh, consistencies that people are going to be doing. They're going to going to the most obvious spots on the map, as right up here on the little freeway. Pick up W2000, and because I'm a beast, I get wall bangs. So. Uh, like up here uh, on these little highway signs, um, any of the new animations like opening yeah. doors or elevators, uh, like in the, the map hotel, people are going to be, you know, testing out all the new stuff, and uh, it's going to be uh, real good pickings for the good players uh, to try to take off all the other guys that are, you know, just look at, lurking around. And uh, as soon as I saw the turned over uh, trailer, in the toward the middle of the map, I knew someone would be camping there eventually, and uh, as you'll be able to see, I was I'm going to be right pretty soon. Uh, of course, with the new maps, you're not going to be very familiar with the spots or the routes to run, so I recommend just sticking with a, a gun setup that you're comfortable with. You just can't go wrong with the FAMAS, dual mag attachments, hardline slide of hand hacker. Here I'm rocking the uh, spy plane. Uh, Blackbird and Chopper Gunner killstreak setup, and this convoy map is a great map for rushing around because uh, of the uh, the broken freeway is kind of at a peak as you go uphill from either side. There's going to be some, but not a lot of action going on. So most of the action is going to be going on the sides of the map, and it being such a large map, pretty much all of the uh, the maps released in this map are pretty large maps. And uh, so it's going to be real beneficial of you to rush around and flank from the other side. And you see, I picked up this M16 with a noob tube, and I really don't like noob tubes, so whenever I find one, I use it on the enemy, and I'll show him. And I heard a guy reloading over here, so I had not to shoot at him and make sure I had a clear shot, because I have a kill streak going, I don't want to screw it up. And like I said, you know, they're going to obvious spots, cool looking right, spots, you know, yeah. some unique spots to that level. And, uh, you know, you gotta take advantage of that, capitalize. Of course, there's gonna be a lot of ghost campers lurking in these new maps because they don't know the right camping spot, so they're just gonna be throwing up ghosts, hiding in corners. And it, like I said before, it's my first time ever on Convoy, so I thought you could exit that way, but apparently not. I switched the M16 that I picked up right here because I knew there was gonna be a lot of long-range engagements as I come down this hill with my Blackbird intact. I don't know how that guy got up there, but it, that looks like a pretty crappy spot. But like I said, an obvious, unique, cool little looking spot. People are going to be flocking to those. And of course you're going to have plenty of people trying to uh, see if these maps are good for sniping. And speaking of sniping, uh, these maps are all pretty large maps and seem like pretty good maps for sniping. Um, the only one I've tried it on so far is Zoo. And that is a pretty darn good map for sniping, I gotta say. First time I went out there, I went uh, 24 and 12. Uh, just go ahead and uh, dominate the, uh, the little railing on the rail carts and uh, get a real good vantage point. And uh, since there's not a lot of uh, buildings in this map, it's pretty pretty darn good for air support. I see I, just, I rack up the kills. Only one guy is trying to shoot me down and I make sure to put all my attention on him as he keeps spawning because he doesn't have Ghost Pro. And see I'm able to take him out right there. <laughs> Along with his buddies, those cars are explosive in case you didn't know. 
I didn't know till now, but there you go. Now, uh, with with the other maps, uh, hotel, hotel is a camper's paradise. You just nothing but uh, people camping up in the top balconies from the uh, opposing hotels. There's two hotels in the middle. There's a pool bar area. And what you're just going to be finding is people camping up in those top windows relentlessly with like, you know, M16s and, you know, silence galils galore with camera spikes and claymores. So be sure to be using Hacker Pro. Uh, it'll give away the position of those campers using Ghost and you'll be able to capitalize. The other map, uh, Stockpile, also pretty popular with the camping because the map is so centered around one central giant warehouse. And uh, it's pretty big, it looks like it's pretty good for sniping. And if I ever get any good scores, I'll be sure to show you guys. Saw this guy right here. Uh, Alright, at least I heard him. Uh, direct impact him with the stun grenade, so I know he wasn't going anywhere. He had a buddy right here. So, go back right to him. He's trying to get me with the frag, but... Not even Ghost can help you when you're a crappy player. Take the engagement out on this gist guy. I get him out with his biplane. Throw that shit up. And like I said before, uh, I knew someone was going to be in that trailer. Uh, it tipped over on side, so took a quick look. Throw down the claymore as a death wish and get wiped out by a ghost kid. But that's okay. I got a, I still got a spy plane in my back pocket, which uh, I do recommend, especially on these new maps. Throw up the spy plane. <laughs> like I said, here's someone in the trailer checking it out because it's unique and kind of cool because everything's like upside down. So again, pretty obvious spot to find somebody. And I was able to take him out. And uh, that's what you're going to be seeing, people climbing up the missile to get out. to the freeway signs, which is, you know, great advantageous spot, especially for snipers. You saw me with the WA-2000 there earlier. We got this. Also plenty of uh, campers like Rock and Black Jacket Pro to make them immune to uh, people who know where they are with grenades. Now you see this guy behind the barrel. I knew he wasn't a sniper by the gun he was using, so I'm still burst firing, but I knew I didn't have the advantage in that match, so I decided to get out of dodge right there. And that's what you gotta do. I mean, he was controlling the engagement, he was head glitching that, uh, that barrel, so I just decided, you know what, that's not a gunfight that I want. And I, I went to leave, and uh... Came back here, these guys are spawning, not all of them have ghost, and I don't know what happened there, uh, we killed each other. I don't know if that was lag, or, uh, his second chance didn't work quite well, or, or what. But I get the final kill there. Pretty good game, like I said, first time on Convoy, not a bad score if I do say so myself. Check out the maps, guys, they're pretty cool, a couple of them are sniper friendly. Final score is 43 and 6, with 2 assists, and... Be sure to subscribe, giving me a like rating really helps out my channel, and I will see you guys later.